Okay. Should be all good now. Hopefully it looks all good. Oh, what a mess trying to stream tonight. I ended up just doing retro stuff because I could not get my PlayStation to connect to the internet whatsoever for some reason, so that's a thing. So we doing this instead, basically. Uh, 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 uh. I didn't want to start Area 2, bruh, bruh. Why is it starting here? Hang on. There we go. Do -do 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 -do. The good old Jag. Jaguar. Yeah, I think it's fine. <sighs> okay. Yeah, there's literally no music in this during gameplay, just for the record. <laughs> and so if it sounds quiet, that's exactly why. In this version, it is, unfortunately. Because otherwise, it's a very good version. What's the button? Oh, that's one. Right. I never remember the controls. Okay. And maybe I should have music on in the background for this. That would probably make sense, hey? At least if I didn't suck. There we go. <laughs> I literally just picked this game because I l had no idea what to play. I li like I got home, I fully intended on playing Minecraft. I started it up and stuff, and then the connection wasn't working. Like it, my PS5 would just not connect to the internet, and I can't restart the internet because someone else is on it. So I don't know because obviously it's not an internet problem, but sometimes when you restart, it, problems go away. Um. So yeah, so I'm kind of stuck doing this so here we are doom on jaguar it's the like quickest thing i could think of i didn't want to do sega again because i had to stand there and figure out what game to play and i was like eh i've been kind of wanting to do like a full stream of this for a little while so we'll just do this maybe we'll play some other games i don't know we'll see we'll see how do you get into this area again i don't remember you can't just walk over and click on it right no, there's like a button somewhere. I don't remember. I don't remember. Bro. Of course, now it blows up like right after it. <laughs> what is strife? Okay, you hold B and then the D-pad. This game is such a weird game to play with a D-pad, just for the record. <laughs> I could have probably just streamed, like, Doom 2 or something straight from my PlayStation. Oh, no, well, I couldn't because I didn't have internet. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. It's okay. We can chill out and play this, right? Let's go get that shotgun right away. 
I hope everything sounds okay and stuff. Once again, I didn't have a chance to check anything. I li like I took so long at band. I had band tonight, by the way, and um, we were doing like vocals and stuff, and we recorded a few songs. And I was like, oh well, I might as well just stay and do this because like streaming, as much as I love it, is secondary to band. And um, yeah, so we basically worked on some songs, and then by the time I got home, it was like. 11.30 my time. And then I was trying to get that to work for like a half an hour and literally I could not get my PlayStation to connect to the internet for whatever reason. I don't know what that reason is. But man, frustrating. Hopefully the PlayStation's okay though. Kind of worried about it. You know. Oh, where's the... How do I open that door again? It's down here, isn't it? So, whatever. We'll do this instead. We can take our time doing the Ferris wheel anyways. Which was what I was gonna do. Click. Wait, I have... Do I... I can't pick that up, right? Because I have, like, four ammo in here. Okay. I feel like I have to talk over this because there's no music. <laughs> it's so brutal. If I couldn't, I wouldn't have copyright issues. I would play Slayer or something that like fits fits the theme of the game. But we cannot. Just add music and post. Sorry to hear that. Oh, no, I, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I think it's just a... It, it's where my PlayStation is, is located. It sometimes, like, has trouble connecting to the Internet, so it's kind of easier for me to connect with the laptop. Um, so, yeah, we're basically just doing this because I couldn't connect to the Internet for, like, the last half an hour I was trying to do that. But that's all. On the bright side, we got a bunch of shit done at band, so that's that's cool. Welcome, by the way. I did see your message asking if I was streaming, and I, and I honestly just didn't get a chance to answer because I was just starting. I was like, well, that answers the question. <laughs> Everything sounds and looks good, though, right? I, I honestly I had no time to even check this stuff because I was like, man, I got to do something. Uh, I don't like not streaming. I don't know. Especially if I have, a, like, a schedule or I say the night before I'm going to stream, then, like, I usually don't back out of that. Keeping a schedule is important. Especially streaming. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. See, I knew you get it. Ow. Why did I stand close to that? I'm so dumb. <laughs> so dumb sometimes. How are you doing? Sorry. I'm just trying to talk because there's no music in the game. <laughs> except for the menu screens. Which is really stupid, I know. Um, so I feel like I have to talk because it's just so quiet otherwise. Kind of a blah day. Well, it's better than a bad day. <laughs> Sadly. Uh, no okay day. Went in the home again. 
as per usual. Four, right? Yeah, okay. Sorry, the controls for this game are very weird. And unless I have a camera, it's really hard to explain to people why the controls are weird. Like, playing Doom on a mount with a mouse and keyboard, obviously, ideal, right? Um, Playing it on Jaguar, as good as this version of the game is, like, look-wise and, like, gameplay-wise, like, it's not crazy laggy or anything. It runs pretty well. Um... The controls are a bit eh, because <laughs> the Atari Jaguar does not have a good directional pad, which is really annoying. And um, the only real cool thing about it is that you can select um, you can select your weapons because there's like a number pad on the controller, like a telephone number pad. Let me pause for a second. Play Spotify on your phone to have some background noise. Um, see, I can't put it on Spotify because it's copyrighted music, right? So it has to be Monster Cat. I could log into that on my phone, you know. I suppose. That's some old school stream shit. I haven't done that in a long time. <laughs> but then the other thing is, is that the stream chat is open on my phone too. So it's like I got to turn off chat for a second. Hang on. This is so scuffed. Um. Give me one second. Uno momento. Uh, Monster Cat player. At first I thought that I didn't have my realm because it said your realm has run out of subscription or something like that. Click here to... Um, renew and I was like oh what that doesn't make sense because it's just renewed and um then I realized that the internet just wasn't working and that's why it was giving me that message so I don't know what's going on there hopefully it gets figured out I'm sure it will we'll put on that uh infected mushroom music How loud is this going to be, this question? <laughs> okay. This is the most scuffed stream I've ever done, but this music should fit kind of with the theme. It's not exactly metal, but, you know, it's got it's got metal vibes. I don't know if you've ever heard of this group before, but they've been around for a long while. Might as well just blast it, I guess. So there's music on the menus when you beat a level, but not in the game. It's so stupid. <laughs> it's so scuffed. Still there? Does it sound good? Hopefully.
try not to shoot the barrels because that will get me killed very quickly. Okay, cool. I'm assuming it sounds better now, hopefully. Dude, I can't even hit him. That's so stupid. Lame. Whatever. Go back to this. I'm better for long range. How are you not dead? I shot him so many times. What did we do at Ban? Um, we're still working on like the EP stuff a little bit, just slowly. Because we're going to release those throughout the year, kind of just little tiny projects. And uh, we were talking about like doing new set lists and stuff for the shows that we're going to have coming up soon, hopefully. Sure if I don't answer right away, by the way, because I, if I have where I have the music on, it's like a short chord, so I have to like have it on my lap, so I can't like have it in my eye view. I bet though, after stream, I'll reset the internet, and um, and it'll probably won't have a single problem, honestly. I guarantee it. I thought there was another one up here, but I guess he died. I guess he died. He did not make it. No worries. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate it. You're so understanding. I don't know how long stream is going to be. I didn't plan on starting this late, honestly. I was going to leave earlier, but where we were recording stuff, I didn't want to, you know. We're basically trying to get, like, the perfect take of something. That's the thing about when you're doing recordings like that, is you're trying to get, like, the bass track, where it's just, like, uh, me and Aaron and Mike just playing through the song entirely with no cuts. Trying to get that perfect is really hard. And you get that perfect, and then you add, you know, two guitar tracks on top to thicken it up and another bass track and the vocals and you just double things to make it more full, right? So. Yeah. Well, that worked out. This level's a bit more laggy. I feel like I should brighten this up a bit. It's pretty dark, isn't it? Hang on a second. Maybe not that 
much. That's a bit much. How's that? Uh, that's a little bit better. This version of Doom is so dark. Where? Who is even shooting me right now? I don't, oh, you're right there. Okay, I was like, I didn't even see him. I'm trying to get the guy up high first because they're more annoying. There's some shotgun guys up there. about the shotgun dudes. No, I'm gonna die. There's no way I'm gonna do this. I don't want to lose my gun. Please. Yes, there we go. God dang, we gotta get health. That was rough. I forgot about the ambush you from behind there. Health, please. Lots of armor around. Take your time, that's all. Some health. This is not a good spot to be when I have low health. Like, even remotely. Oh shit. There's another guy over there. Did not mean to jump off there, but okay. We'll take it. Oh no. That was close. Please, just like a, a morsel, a tidbit of health. I don't know how I'm still alive. I just jinxed it, didn't I? <laughs> so we have to go in that sewer part. We can't do that unless of the waste. Ah, oh, there's so many enemies here too. I wish I knew where there was some health, like, for sure. There's some. I wouldn't be wasting so much ammo if I didn't, like, want to not lose all my health. You'll feel better when I'm not bleeding from the eyes. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is not the one. Where's the door that we need to go in? see over there probably gotta be careful these guys too because the shotgun dudes do so much fucking damage I'm doing terrible right now 40 okay I feel a little bit better no more up here. We need... Oh, this is the blue door. Okay. I was going to say. I know there's health in here. I just don't know around what corner. So I'm kind of... We'll take our time. Ow. 
Ow. <laughs> not cool, bro. Not cool. I hate it when they don't die one hit. Come on, dude. You just took a shotgun to the face at point blank. I know you're a demon and all that, but... Like, come on. <laughs> I was about to say demons are humans, too, but that... <laughs> that's not right. Or is it? There it goes. That's what I expect. Oh, no. It's a pinky. I forgot about the pinkies. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. It's so weird having music on when I'm playing retro. I'm not used to this. I mean, it always occurred to me that I could do this. Because I, I used to do this. This is how I used to do the Minecraft music before I had a laptop. But it's not a... Okay, could you die? Thank you. Who is shooting me now? Oh my god. That guy just like spam killed me. Oh, I was doing so good. And by good, I mean terrible. Now we gotta do it with like minimal weapons right from the start. It's okay, we got more health to work with now, so I'm feeling a little bit better about it, I guess. We could play another game too, this doesn't have to be specifically Doom, I just... This was the first game that I picked to put in here and try. See how much health you lose from those guys? Like, it's ridiculous. I cannot hit that barrel at all, apparently. Apparently, that's just not possible. Bruh. This is so hard without weapons. I'll try one more. See, when I hit those barrels, it takes out all the shotgun guys that are up top. Which obviously is ideal. Me and my bass player are going to go out to lunch this week, so that's pretty cool. Me and Aaron. I'm excited. We don't get much time to hang out outside of band anymore. We used to hang out a lot more, but, you know, you be busy and all that, all that nonsense. Could you please just hit the barrel up there? No, yeah, I'm dead. There's no way. There's too many dudes here for this. Literally one health. Like, there's no way. Like, I'm literally aiming directly at the barrel, and it's not even... See, don't help me now. It's no good now. I'm, I'm doomed. There's no way. There's no way I'm doing this now. Once you lose your weapons, you're kind of screwed. Just a tad. See. That'll be fun. Yeah, yeah. I, I picked the place for us to go. I, I, there's a place I really like. It's like a diner. It's kind of new. But it's really good. Hang on. I'll change the game now. Once again, I don't have many games for Jaguar. I just picked it because it was the easiest thing to set up real quick. <laughs> so it's going to be kind of games we've already seen, but that's all I can do. I will turn off the music right now, though, because I don't need it. I only really need it for that one.
so scuffed. <laughs> Since like the four band, my voice is gone. I don't know if you can hear it. <laughs> this game's horrible. <laughs> it's not as bad as everyone makes it out to be, actually. But we've played this before. Again, up, down, gas, shoot, break. Okay, gotcha. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right, there's no music in game here either. <laughs> I'm glad that I forgot all about that. Whatever, well, it's fine. I'm not gonna try and set that up again. Take me another five minutes. Might as well just chill. Might as well just chill. So the whole goal here is just to collect those, like, yellow crystals, basically. <laughs> Very simple game. This was the game that came with the console when you bought it brand new back in the day. <laughs> FYI. I mean, I suppose I could have done, like, 3DO today, but I don't know. See, not all my consoles are set up all at once. So, like, it's the kind of thing where, like, I gotta be, I have to, like, take it apart and, you know, reconnect it to this little box that I stream from. Well Which isn't always easy. I remember seeing this game a long time ago. I don't know where I seen it first. But I remember seeing it somewhere, someone playing it. Not like a review or anything, but like an actual person I knew had it. I don't know who it was. But I remember thinking it looked really cool back in the day. And now I'm like, man. Man. I don't know if I told this on stream before, but I actually, when I got my Jaguar, um, the only game I had with it was a game called Hover Strike, and, um, I'll do this one first, and, uh, games for this are very expensive, so I bought Doom, which I think was $90 when I bought it originally, probably the most expensive one I own for this, all the other ones were pretty cheap, um, and this game was five dollars because it wasn't working it was at a flea market and i um bought it and unscrewed it and took it apart and uh literally i just like i never even had to fix anything i just had to like resolder like one of the chips that was on there it was just like one of the pins on the chip was out and when i resoldered it it worked fine the only thing that sucks about it is that these games like the cartridges i don't know if you know anything like about any of the game cartridges but like you know how, like, Sega and Nintendo cartridges, the screws to open them up are on, like, the back? On Jaguar, they're under the label. <laughs> like, the actual label, with like, the image of what, what, of what game it is. They're on that, under that, and you have to peel back the label to get to the screws, which sucks because it ruins the label on the cartridge. But, you know, it's better than, than not having it. It's nice having, like, an actual... And I feel like where this is one of the launch games, this is one that like is good to have. Jaguar didn't have a whole lot of games. Has more games nowadays, honestly. A lot of fans make games for this console nowadays, like, and they're actually quite good. From what I've seen, I don't have any of them, obviously. I ain't got money for that. I never had money for that when I had a job to to buy games for this because <laughs> it was so this is so expensive. It's such an expensive console. Mm 
it's funny because like I think like one of the reasons I wanted this console was because it was such an obscure, weird console to have. And I didn't even really want to get it that much because I was like, oh, it's kind of expensive. I don't really need it. And my best friend was like, you have to buy it. You have to buy it. <laughs> He's a bad influence. We all have friends who are bad influences. And if you don't, guess what? You're the <laughs> you're the bad influence. Okay, and we're done. That's true, isn't it? I did apply to a few jobs last night, and two of them reviewed my resume, or looked at my resume, so hopefully I might get a call from them, maybe. I hope so. We'll see. Still trying. Once I get one, I'll be working hard. It's honestly mind-blowing the amount of stuff that's around because you'd think that you'd get a call from them, but no, not very many of them. So we'll see. I think one of the ones that looked at it too is like a job that closes at like 9 p.m. So I think they open at like 9 and they close at 9 or something like that. And I'm like, that is like actually great for me and like my general schedule because, you know, with band being usually on Saturdays or whatever late. And then, um, you know, shows like getting off at 9 p.m. and going to doing shows is easy. So that's cool. Do -do -do -do. I don't know which one to do next. This one, I guess. It's the easier one. Less pods. Do -do 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 -do. Good luck. <laughs> Where did you learn to fly? That's what she says when you crash into something. This game is like made fun of so hard for that. <laughs> I don't blame people. It's pretty funny. Good work. Good work. It's funny because uh, she says, where did you learn to fly? Like when you bang into stuff. So like if I like bump into like a uh, a wall, there's not really, see? But there's not really a way to, um, to stop bumping into the wall. You kind of just like bounce off of it over and over again. And then it, it, she just keeps freaking saying it. But in my version of the game, she doesn't do that. Well and I looked it up because I knew that that was like a thing that happened in this game. And um, apparently what happened was the release version of it that came out with the console had that where she would do that all the time. And people found it so annoying that when they sold the game separately from the console later on, they updated it and removed her saying that as often. <laughs> so like there's like a fixed version of it. And that makes me laugh. Um, this one. I don't even think we've died yet, have we? Now that I said that. <laughs> now that I said that. Time to die. Uh, 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 uh. I mean, it's not horrible for its time. Like, it's not the worst looking game ever, but like, it's not, it's not good. <laughs> it's not particularly good looking either. Bro, like I totally just tried, tried to steal my crystal and that is not cool. There's these random ships in this level that like pick them up and move the crystals around. It's really annoying. 
Because I'm trying to go by my radar and find them. Well done. Where did you learn to fly? Go this way. Well Sadie. Gotcha. Oof. It's a bit touchy. The controls are a bit touchy. This game was so bad that they made a sequel. <laughs> like, there's an actual sequel for this. But I think... I think it only came out for the Jaguar CD. Which is an add-on to this console. That costs entirely too much money. Like, this console is already expensive. And I'm pretty sure the Jaguar CD is, like, over a thousand dollars. Which is ridiculous. Because a lot of times they don't work. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a very well-known console for not working properly. You, you see that? Excuse me there? Excuse me? Where's he going? Where are you going with my crystal? Get back here. I don't think so. I don't think so, sir. Good morning. It's weird to think that like this, that like 3D graphics like this were like a thing. And this is only like a few years before like Mario 64 and like all these like really classic 3D games. It's amazing how much like technology progressed around that time. Like we were doing crude 3D graphics and then like in a matter of years we had like ones that were like actually like you could tell what they were, you know. Like this game looks good, but like, you know, the ground is kind of stupid looking. Like you can tell the blue is the water, but it's not, you know. Oh my god, did you just spawn me on top and kill me immediately again? I think he did. I don't know. Like, nothing's textured. Ah, uh, let's do this one. This is one of the consoles that if I sold my most of my collection, I wouldn't sell though. I, I'd keep, I'd keep my Sega stuff, and I'd keep my Jaguar and my 3DO. And that's probably it. I'd probably get rid of most of the Nintendo stuff later on, not right away. Well kind of, it's weird. <laughs> Trying to get used to selling stuff is weird. But I mean, my GameCube is gone now, so that's a thing. I'll get there. I'll get there. It is true though. Once I sold like a few of my games, I was like, I was like really trying to find stuff that I didn't, that I don't play to get rid of. You know, stuff that's in my collection that I just have because like I saw it at a thrift store and just impulse bought it. You know, to have it in a collection, which like my PS2 might be the next one I think I might go uh, and do that with because there's a lot of games for PS2 that I really like. I just don't play. It's not necessarily getting rid of the whole collection, but even if I have to. Because, like, say, let's just say, I don't know what the exact number is, but let's just say I have 100 PS2 games. If I narrowed that down to, like, 50 or lower, you know, it'd be a lot easier to manage. And especially if I move or if I do something, it wouldn't be hard to get it going somewhere. But, like, right now, there's just so much. There's so much, and so much I don't play. Whereas with Sega stuff, like, I have a lot of Sega games, but gen genuinely, I do play most of them. Like, legitimately. By myself, or I play them on stream, or I play them with my friends, and it's like... That's the stuff I'm really interested in, you know? And, like, with Jaguar, like, I, I barely have anything for this. I have, I, I think I literally have five games. What do I have? Iron Soldier, Checkered Flag, Cybermorph. Doom and Hover Strike. Yeah, five games. Makes sense. Good morning. Like, it's nice having it, but at the same time, it's the kind of thing, too, where it's like, well, 
this stuff is worth money for a certain amount of time while, you know, it still works. And this stuff inevitably in the future, especially disc stuff, like stuff on CDs and DVDs, are going to degrade really fast. And they're not going to be playable anymore. And at that point, your games are going to be worthless because they're not going to work anymore. So you might as well offload it while you have a chance to offload it, you know? You... Damn stupid ship stealing my damn crystals. Like, do you mind? Well I gotta go friggin' find all of them. There's one going this way, so I'll get him first. It's so hard to control. <laughs> Plus, I think, like, obscure consoles like the Jaguar and the 3DO I really enjoy because there's so many games on it that I can play that, I mean, for the most part, a lot of the games for this are, like, cheap. They're expensive in the grand scheme of things, but they're still cheaper than buying, like, a brand new PlayStation 5 game because a brand new PlayStation 5 game is literally $100 taxes in, right? Um, And, you know, you can get games for this for, like, 50 or something. And it's like, you know, if I enjoy playing a game on this or any other console like that and get the same amount of enjoyment out of it as I do with a $100 game that, like, I, I genuinely, with PS5 games and stuff, like, nowadays, I don't play them as much as I play the retro stuff because there's so much, like, microtransactions and stuff in them that you have to put more money into the game after just paying $100 to be good at the game. is like, that's, like, ridiculous. Like, why would I want to do that, you know? Plus, games like this are cool, because even when you have friends over or people that don't know anything about these games, they can, they get used to it, you know? Like, they, they look at it, and they're like, oh, man, like, this is cool. Like, I've, I heard about a Jaguar, but, like, I've never seen an entire Jaguar before, and it's, like, a cool thing. Where do I go next? <sighs> and then the other thing with this is that, like, um, like I was saying, me and my best friend, like, we both, I collect more than he does for the most part, but I got him into collecting. He had a Sega growing up, same as me, and, um, when he got older, he got rid of a lot of it, but he used to go back and play it occasionally, um, and then once he started coming over to my house and playing the games all the time, he was like, oh, well, I should just go out and get this stuff. So, like, we kind of just both collect. And even, like, certain games that I don't have, he does. And then, like, he'll bring it over and we'll play it or whatever, right? So if either one of us get new games, we'll just, like, share. Like, I would have never even knew about playing Cool Spot at all if it wasn't for him because he's the person that introduced me to that game. Good work. Where did you learn to fly? I know I have other weapons, but I'm not going to waste them yet. If we get to the second full level of level... Second stage of levels. We'll, uh, we'll do that. Portal opened. Portal is just basically the way to get out of the level. FYI. Ow. I'll probably stop streaming in like 10 minutes or so. We'll probably just do like an hour. I don't think we need to do more than an hour. The only game I'd really like to have for this console is um, Alien vs. Predator, but it's so expensive. Like, I, occasionally, like, I'll just check in and look and just see how, how, how if prices have changed around this console, but, like, man, I swear, they, they, like, don't budge on this console. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the obscurity of it, but, like, they literally, they don't move. What am I doing tomorrow? Um, I'm gonna go into home again. 
I wouldn't even go in every single day right now, but I'm kind of just going in every single day until she settles in and gets used to it. Plus, she keeps asking for me to be there when I'm not there. Like, when my mother goes in or someone, she wants me there, so I'll go in. I don't mind. Um, and, uh... Sorry, this is rough. There we go. <laughs> and uh, after that, I'm not really sure. I'll figure something out. I don't know, man. The last couple days for me, I've been so tired, too. I don't know what it is. Like I said, I think it's my thyroid. Because, like, even when I get sleep, like, if I went to sleep, like, you know, 10 o'clock in the night, and then woke up at, like, 2 p.m. the next day. I swear to you, I would still be tired as heck. Like, I don't know what it is. But, like, I'm just consistently tired all the time. Like, I feel like I'm going to fall asleep. And it sucks. Because I hate feeling that way. There's nothing worse than feeling tired. Because then you just want to go to sleep. And it's like, like, obviously you can't because you have things to do. Or, you know, whatnot. And it's like, man, it sucks. And then at that point, once you're a certain, like, once you're really tired, even having naps kind of ruins it. Because then you get those naps where you wake up and you feel worse after you wake up. There's still another crystal here somewhere, apparently. But I didn't see it. Am I blind? Probably. They're all in between these buildings on this one. That's kind of... The, the enemies aren't so bad here. It's just... The buildings are just so annoying to get around. Like, how am I supposed to get that? Why do I change weapons? Oh, oh, that's not it. There we go. Is that it? No, that just turns my crosshair around, apparently. What is this, first person? Would you believe me if I told you I didn't even know there was a first person? <laughs> view in this. Well, there's also, like, an outside view. That's interesting. Okay. It's kind of cool, actually. Oh, shit. Oh, now I'm, like, backwards. Okay. I don't know why you would want to have that view, but sure. It's kind of nice with the aiming thing, actually. I don't know how to turn it off now, though. <laughs> I'm an idiot. It's literally in the middle of these buildings, but like, how am I supposed to get it? I can't get it because I can't blow up the fucking buildings. There we go. Feeling reckless or mo no mo motivation to do anything? Yeah, you're in kind of like a rut, I guess, right? I understand that. I really do. kind of how I was for like the first month after my job thing. It's kind of just like mm, just like I don't know, brutal. It's just like you don't feel like doing anything. You're kind of like eh, I don't want to go out anywhere. I don't want to go do this. I don't want to work. I don't want to blah blah blah. I just want to stay in bed all day or something. <laughs> just lie on the couch. How legitimately though, how am I supposed to get Oh, is that it? That's it. I just figured it out. The pause button. The pause button is what I press to change weapons. That is freaking stupid. Wait, what? Is it a mine? <laughs> is that what that is? Oh, wrong button. damn crystal. I don't give a shit. I'm not giving up. This is the closest that I've gotten to actually doing good in this game in a while. Portal open? No, no portal open. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm sorry you feel that way. That sucks. 
Like, I, I, it's not... It's not that I'm not motivated to do things. Like, I'm trying to do things, but it's hard for me to... Ugh, I don't know. Like, I'm so tired all the time that it's just hard to concentrate on anything, I think, is my thing. You know? Like, even at Jam, I'm having, like, a rough go trying to, like, come up with things. I'm just completely... I don't know. I'm just bleh. <laughs> if that makes sense. Crashing in there, better than me. My bad. My bad, boys. I literally have one crystal to go, really. Maybe I'll play Iron Soldier just for like a minute. I do want to play something else here. I'm not even going to do the score because it doesn't matter, does it? I love this intro screen. I don't know why. It's so neat. I got someone coming along to pick up a bunch of games I was selling this week, so that's cool too. Get that out of the way, and then uh, a few other things. I've sold almost everything I put up so far, so that's cool. I just always thought this menu screen was cool that you could scroll through the drawing. I know it's kind of weird, but like, why would you want to? But <laughs> but you can. It's a thing you can do. <laughs> can you imagine if I got like affiliate or something like that on Twitch, and then I could have my own emotes? That would be cool. Don't judge me, I am playing this on easy just because this game is ridiculously hard to control. I do like this game, though. Start with the first level. Start off with one weapon. The more you play, to get more weapons. This is a weird game. It's like you have an accelerator that you just leave on. Like you can see it up in the top right corner. You can see the little red bar. It shows like how fast I'm going. If I want to go backwards, I have to like do that. And it goes on its own. Like you don't have to hold down on the button. You just turn while your mech is walking or whatever. Pretty good looking game for its time though. I always like playing it. Not the best game ever, but it, it has its it has a charm. I wonder if you searched on Twitch right now how many people are streaming Atari Jaguar games. I bet you I'm probably one of, if not the only person doing it. Wouldn't doubt it. Who's, who is shooting at me right now? It's probably this tank or that helicopter. I love that the trees explode. So many games back in the day that didn't want to, like, obviously show the tree breaking or something like that because it would be too much, too labor intensive on the hardware to just be like, oh, tree explodes. Exploding trees. I mean, maybe I'm not. Maybe there is someone else playing Jaguar. I can't be the only person in the world. 
like in the entire world and all the streamers that are on Twitch right now, I cannot be the only person. Like, there's no way. I'm not the only loser. <laughs> Please. Yeah, there you are. See, I'm playing with the other controls in the last game now because I'm stunned. How do I change to my hand? Do you have another weapon on there? I guess not. Okay, I keep forgetting that there's like a... It's weird too, your head of your mech moves independently from um, the body. So like if you see me like overturning like that, it's because I'm like turning the torso of the mech. And stopping is the worst part about this, like it's so hard to stop. I'm trying to find some health. And or ammo. Here's here's where everybody's at. I don't want to run out of ammo. I'm screwed if I run out of ammo. Why are they running away from me? It's only a giant walking tank. Stop being so scared. behind me. The helicopters are brutal because they, they move around so fast. Like, the tanks are really slow. The polygons are actually textured in this game, though. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy for the time. <sighs> Turn. Come forward. God, this is so hard to control. There's a sequel to this game, too. There's two sequels to this game, believe it or not. There's one for the Jaguar CD. I think it came out for the regular Jag, too. And then there's one for PlayStation, I think. I'm determined to at least beat the first level. I've gotten to, like, the eighth level, and after that, it's it, this game gets ridiculously hard. Because they start actually, like, having more, like, not just tanks and stuff. Like, there's actual mechs attacking you, too. And then when that happens, that kind of sucks. Um, okay, I know there's a tank here somewhere. And there's two guys left. There's the tank. Okay, he's gone. Oh, oh, three guys left. Every time I turn around, there's more. Am I supposed to be doing something specific in this? I don't even know. Or am I just supposed to be killing these dudes? I don't remember. I didn't read the objective because I'm an idiot. <laughs> because I'm an idiot. Oh, there's the fist thing. Okay. Hey, you can punch things too. <laughs> Everything explodes into tiny cardboard boxes. <laughs> I think I think I was supposed to like destroy the helipad or something here. I don't remember. The last time I played this game was probably the last time JB was over, which was a long while ago now. He's in um He's in Yellow Knife currently. So he freezing his butt off is what he's doing. If you know where Yellow Knife is.
trying to figure out. There's a, there's a spot here where I can go and get ammo, and I don't know where it is. <laughs> there's buildings you can break. Yeah, the ones with the smokestacks, I think, are the ones. I mean, beat the shit out of the building with my, with my nub. Paired. So that was health. Okay. Nothing in that one, really. Probably should have read the objectives, if I'm being honest, and not been an idiot and just. I didn't get any ammo out of that, did I? Where's my gun? How do I select gun? There's so many buttons. I don't know which button I'm supposed to press for gun. <laughs> Come here, I punch you. I punch you. Helicopter, leave me alone. Stop bullying me. I literally can't do anything if I don't have ammo. I was just shooting everything that moved, and, and I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> Apparently. Apparently that was not the objective. Why am I only getting repair? <laughs> what is this? What is this? Yeah, we'll continue on. If I don't figure it out by the time we get to this section, I'm just going to quit. I should have read the objective. I forgot how to play this game. Usually there's ones like, oh, destroy this building, and then the mission ends. Like, you don't actually have to destroy all the enemies or anything. Some of them are destroyed the enemies, though. Rifle reload. Okay, but how do I select my rifle? Here we go. A bad looking game though for its time. It's it's not the best, but there's definitely something that I was supposed to do because like the helicopters are just respawning. So that tells me I fucked up. <laughs> I feel like there was something I was supposed to do over that way though. Eh, whatever. Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to end stream here. Might as well. Uh-oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, well, I tried to stream something. It's not as good as what it would have been, but... <laughs> Thanks for watching. Okay, I'll see you again tomorrow night. Bye-bye.